TLO, what's poppin'? We are on Twitch. We are live. And by the time you see this, we won't be. So just leave a like, comment, subscribe, turn on your post notification bells. Let's continue to grow the family from Chicago to the UK, man. Right behind me, you see it. Central Sea cooks authentic Guyanese food with vice called Family Food. Twitch.com is where you can catch a live stream. Usernames at the bottom of the screen. And we also got Patreon where we post seven to ten times a week. UK UK series, UK movies, and Premier League, man. Uh, talk to me. Talk to me. Copyright disclaimer under Section 107 of the Copyright Act 1976. Allowance is made for fair use for purposes such as criticism, comment, news reporting, teaching, scholarship, and research. Fair use is a use permitted by copyright statute that might otherwise be infringing. Nonprofit, educational, or personal use tips the balance in favor of fair use. No copyright infringement intended. All rights belong to their respective owners. I'm not going to lie. Before Central Sea, I never knew what Guyanese was. So I know Central Sea is Guyanese, and then um, Ace, you know the YouTuber Ace from Miami, he went to the UK and he went to Carnival, and they had a bunch of Guyanese girls in there. So I was like, oh, yo, okay understood so you know this is a whole new culture for me i just couldn't even imagine mm. the biggest rapper in the uk would be at my show put some fire in here guys come on come on Woo. <laughs> we produce authentic Chinese food mm -hmm. it? my best sellers is goat curry chicken curry pumpkin and chicken this is our speciality london's best so wait, what kind of, wait, hold on now. What kind of food, where is, where, where are the Guyanese people from? Where, where are they located at? When I decided Asia? to open this business, my husband said, if you're going to do Guyanese food, put it in a name that all the Guyanese people know. And I decided it's going to be Yumaniana, the meeting place of the people. I've over so many years, we became a fabric of the, community. I see some boxes outside. What are they? It's five telecommunications. Car Caribbean or South America. Boxes covering the whole front of the restaurant. The sales has dropped. We start to struggle to survive. I'm pretty sure y'all doing pretty decent now. Y'all need Keith Lee to come. Not Central Sea. My name is Deborah Monfrey. My name is Deborah Monfrey, and I'm the owner of Humana Yana. We are in Horn Hill, South London, and I have been running the shop for 15 years. It do kind of look like Jamaican food. Also, it kind of look like. Asian food. We produce authentic Chinese food. I grew up in Guyana and I was born in Guyana. Guyana, okay. Guyana. My mom was a brilliant cook and she taught us, all of us, to cook. She was known for cooking the best rotis in the whole of Guyana. I'm continuing my mom's legacy. I want to be known like my mom to make the best roti and I'm doing it in the uk the uh chili as well a bit uh, tiny bit or medium medium amount please. you're brave man <laughs> <laughs> all my curries cook i ain't even gonna lie guyanese like the name guyanese it sounds like they cook hot food like spicy guyanese don't it man hey guyanese yeah look at this similar to each other but it's only the meat is individual and that my curry is a bit uh, tiny bit or medium medium amount you brave man <laughs> <laughs> all my curry is cooked similar to each other but it's only the meat is individual and that gives you the different unique flavors i got four spices and that's it that's my little secret me sharon sharon's rolling the roti this is michael my baby He's doing the washing up, helping his mom. We had a hope to get some pay. <laughs> so basically, it's a family-run restaurant. At first, I started with the kids, and then I was doing it for myself. 
And then my husband joined me in 2019. My husband is Arthur, but we call him Junior. It's a very difficult stuff at times. <laughs> Junior do all the preparations, but sometimes he don't want to do what you want. I ain't gonna lie, the food look like it's banging. I might have to go look up something. I know Miami got some Guyanese food somewhere. Want to do, he wants to do something else. For example, potatoes take him three and a half hours to peel and cut. He hates doing it. He prefers to leave it for last. But because most of my items that I cook need potato, I need the first thing in the morning. And he drives him mad. <laughs> 25 kilos. I've done that under two hours. He's good, he's yeah. good, he's fast. That's, that's my record so far. Under it depends on the size of the potato as well. If they're little mini ones, I'm there forever, like three hours. <laughs> How you doing guys, you okay? Yes, you're right. Hello, hello, hello. good How afternoon. I'm okay. fine, thank you. Good, yeah? Yeah. Good, good, Is it Central C? Yes. So yes. you come here to do this, this cooking lesson today with me? Yeah, yeah, let's do it. <laughs> I got a lovely apron for you and a nice hat for you. Or if you want to keep, or if you want keep on your hat. What are we cooking then? Today we. What you see is gives me like a regular dude vibes. Like really vibes. Like man, I was out here grinding. I was out here nobody four years ago. Now I'm out here made it and generally, generally stayed the same. Like, we have on the menu. I salute that. For you to cook chicken curry, Guyanese paratha roti, and channel, which is chickpea curry. So, how come I got apron and you don't? I got on a jacket, wow. a chef's jacket. <laughs> do I look the part, yeah? You do, you do. My mom teach me to cook, and no measurement. Is Central C full Guyanese? He look full Guyanese. So, so is this true? <laughs> now that I'm looking at this lady, he look like her twin. Like, they are relate. They Y'all better check it. Y'all need some DNA swap or something. Y'all whole everything look the same. That's the way. I'll go by the book. Yeah, we cook and feel. Yeah. What's that? Gee, we're cooking. Oh, yeah. And now we need to get this chicken. That's the curry chicken, brother. Chicken in before it starts to burn. Put you some green over here. Mm. In the meantime, I'll find the potato. Can you smell it? Pop off. Yeah. Ow. It's really good. It's just start the roti now. Yeah. But you keep turning to get a roundness. That's why you keep turning it. Mm -hmm. Central C ain't never cooked a day in his life. Bro make peanut butter and jelly sandwiches night and day. Oh, it's round. What do you mean? Oh, I'm out. Bro don't even know how to roll out a circle. I fucked up already, man. <laughs> You're getting there. Actually perfect. She said it's perfect, so. <laughs> Just flip it. Potatoes. It's all timing though, because look, now I would have burned the I would have burned the roti now. I want to multitask, didn't it? What's the verdict? Honestly, oh, just need a bit more salt and then. He's actually, you know what I'm saying, putting in mass effort. He ain't coming here dry. Mm -hmm. Ain't it? So what kind of dishes do you normally cook? That instant noodles and that. I told you. I said peanut butter and jelly, instant noodles, so it's on the same playing field. Trap meals. <laughs> no, 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 it's not healthy for you. No, no healthy. But after now, no more noodles. Yeah, no, no, no. <laughs> Fresh <I>, vegetables. No. <laughs> so let me just show you the front of the shop right. and explain something. I see some boxes outside. So what are they? It's five telecommunication boxes covering the whole front of the restaurant. The restaurant been around for 15 years, but the third year we was booming, we was minting money. Yeah. So we decided to refurb, um, remortgage our house, refurbish this so that we can really get some good money out of it. Mm. But we did this in February mm. and during the big box. We started to struggle to support. You know, that's crazy. All it takes is them to put cover the restaurant. You can't even see it no more. It's, you're done. That's messed up. For 12 years, myself and my husband have been campaigning to remove the boxes. We did a petition in 2017, the council acknowledged it, and it was decided to put under the bridge or put it against the wall. Five years later, nothing had happened. Right. 
it was decided to. So they won. They got they got the petition. Why wouldn't they put it under the bridge or against the wall in the first place? Why would you put it in front of a storefront? This journalist Isabel Ramones, she determined that we're gonna do something, but I didn't expect her to put it on TikTok. I don't have pension or anything. This is all my investment for me and my family. I love my business. I hope that I can save it. She for me, she said, I can't believe it. It went viral. People were just coming from everywhere. This is an authentic Guyanese restaurant, and this is. I ain't gonna lie, that should do look good. Guyanese food, I gotta try it. It didn't move to the top. That should look amazing. Go back. Oh, wait. Man. Fire. People were just Psst. coming from everywhere. Psst. I don't like how she eating it, but still. This is an authentic guy. Psst. I need And this is authentic guy. Yeah, what's that like? Oh my God. What is this? Any top of food? If it wasn't for my story gone viral, I would not have been able to survive. I saw it on TikTok as well. My brother showed it to my dad. Yeah. Because he used to live around the area. Yes. Too far. Yeah. He said he used to come here and that. Thanks to social media. And thanks to TikTok we have you here. Yeah. yeah. Can I hug you up? Yes. I'm so happy to hug you. I need to make sure I get a picture of you as well then. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you. You also got the channel. The ch That's pretty cool. I ain't gonna lie. This is cool to him. It's pretty cook now when the spinach. All right. You can see I'm not the chef in the family, isn't it? Yep, that's it. All of it. That's it. No. So Central C, what that's going to do is it's going to cook down. It's going to reduce by more than half. So it may look like a lot now, but it's going to cook. It's, it's going to cook down. Okay? You don't cook till you get the juice, but I like it to be crisp. See? How's it taste? What do you think? Yeah, banging. I like that stuff. Awesome. 100%. Now these are chickpeas. You got to add a lot of flavor and seasoning to these because if you don't, they don't taste like nothing. They taste like something uh, and they're not good. My hands for no reason. Try it. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> what, how many roti you got? Oh, I'll flip it, boil it. Sharon, how would you rate his roti? So what's the roti? Like the crispy stuff? Like a little chip type situation? Cooking from zero to ten. You, Be realistic. You're eight. Eight? Yeah. Oh, I'll, take yeah. <laughs> I'll take that. I'll take that. You're eight. <laughs> was ready, yeah? Yeah. Bro, used to the kitchen and the stove. Just not the, you know. So what's this yes. clapping? Right. And just toss it up and clap. Yes. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Put some fire in it. Life, come on, come on. Ooh. What's the purpose of it? <laughs> boy out there clapping roti, ain't he? That's a real guy in this clap. Calm down. That's a real guy in this clap. Is that good, yeah? This is what you're supposed to get when you finish clapping it. Yeah. 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 Ma'am, calm down. <laughs> so, rice and peas are roti. Bring the pepper sauce, please. Hey, use that one. Yeah. That one, that yeah. one. Yeah. 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 You cook it yourself. Cook me love. Yes, lots of love. Ooh, that sauce is hot, though. Mm. That's like fire. Yeah, we don't want that. Because what goes in hot comes out even hotter. You know what I'm saying? Hey, yeah, Papa. <laughs> All right. That's his regular vocab, huh? He said it again. His cooking skills. What do you, what do you think? I, th I think it's good. He's willing to learn. Mm, he's willing yeah. to learn. Should put a bit more effort when he's doing the spinach. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I just hope that he he take the little experience and do it at home. Why would he do that? He rich. You could probably hire y'all to cater, 100%. Hey, Debbie, Central C said, thank you so much. He wanted me to let you know that he'd like to donate oh, wow. 15K towards your camping. Wow. Oh my God, I can't believe oh, this. Ooh. Keep reading. Uh, 10K for the solar panels you fundraising for online and 5K towards meals for those in need of the local community. Oh, I would love to do that. I'm a bit boring, but I want... Salute. 
Chitin may come from my heart. Thank yeah. you. you Thank welcome. you so much. Thank and you. one love. Thank you. Uh, when I go to London, I got to get some Guyanese food. I got to go here 100%. I'm hungry now. And I just ate dinner, man. I'm back on my... You know. It feels great to be um, recognized by the biggest rapper in the UK. But most of all, it makes me feel so proud when the customer come and say, Oh, the food is amazing. We put a lot of love into the food. And anybody that tastes it, always, always come back for into the food and anybody that tastes it all wow, that looks so good all right <laughs> it's all this come back for it and that's because we use special spices but i wouldn't mention it because i don't want you to know it <laughs> it's a secret ancient guy and he's secret i understand <laughs> In October 2024, after 12 after a 12-year 12 campaign, South announced that they will be removing the telecom boxes. Good, yeah. <laughs> to support five. That's all you gotta do, man. Never give up. You're closer to success than failure. 100%, man. Words of TLO. TLO, leave a like, comment. I'm gone.